What is up guys, Downward Skull Surgeon here, and welcome back to the third episode of... I don't know what I'm going to call it, probably just Downward Place Dark Souls. Downward Place Dark Souls, that's a nice ring to it, I might actually just go with that. So, last time we, uh, the Dragon Rider killed us three times, I think it was three, two or three. But, uh, we came back. We came back and got our revenge and we leveled up and now I'm really short on life gems. I had 11, I'm down to 4. But I will not th let that deter me from uh, next objective, which I do believe is the last giant. Yeah, it should be the last giant. Which, uh, according to one of my friends, is a flat out lie. Apparently there's more giants later on in the game. Oop, this is the wrong area. But I wouldn't know because I've never made it that far. I, I'm assuming they're like the Taurus demons in the first one. That they become like really common enemies later on. And for those of you who have, haven't played Dark Souls 1. Uh, Taurus demon becomes a very uh, common enemy. It doesn't actually become that hard actually. Depending on what ones you use I suppose. Uh, I really sound like I'll be like... Oh, I, I know so much about Dark Souls. I'm so good. But, and I don't mean to. I apologize if that's the way I'm coming off. Because I don't even know which way is the way I'm supposed to be going. That really shows. So I really apologize if that's the, uh, the impression I'm giving off. I am not meaning to by any means. I, I am trying to seem at least um, knowledgeable of what I'm doing. At least semi-knowledgeable. Because I'm really, really wanting to keep things interesting. Because I know it's funner if you've seen someone that hasn't uh, played this gameplay before. So then they can get mad. But I'm, I am a rager. Only for very few games. This game luckily can make me rage. Oh, that's a coin. I thought that was a ring. I thought it was like the rest of the iron ring. And... Uh, Dark Souls and Demon Souls never let me ra made me rage only because uh, I had friends helping me. I didn't have them like go with me the entire way through the uh, actual game. But what did end up happening was I, I had them tell me a lot of stuff that I could use. I was like asking them like what's a really good weapon that I could use. And they're like, oh, you, you should get the Great Scythe. And I was like, okay, I'm well, then during the strength build. What's a good strength weapon I should use? Oh, you should use Y-Hander. I was like, oh, okay. Which uh, I ended up being the game with the strength build was Y-Hander and uh, Pavel's uh, armor. Actually, no, it was the Elite Knight armor, Knight armor set, but I also have Pavel's. I've never gone over there. I okay, yeah, I can make it. But I think now I can't go back. I'm pretty sure there's going to be, like, enemies here. Back on this phone. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Just leave down here. That's... Pretty cool. I don't like this area. Like, this area specifically. I'm not a big fan of, like, the really condensed forest areas. I like the big open uh, areas. And a lot of areas that get... That has a lot of hate. Because it's, like, super lazy. Is, uh... The Ruins of Isolith in Dark Souls 1. Which I will admit, it's an extremely lazy level. But... It, I really like the way it looks. Like a lot of people say like it hurts your eyes and it's really bad, but I don't know. Something about it just seems really pretty to me. I don't know, my I could just have bad taste. Uh that's that's a very plausible reason. I'm gonna get this before you hit me. Dodge roll! Oh nope. Well that was that was just positive thinking. But you know what? Positive thinking in this game can get you far. Ooh, you! Oh, that was a shield break. I meant to do a jump attack, but whatever, still hit. So, still works for me. I remember this guy gives you a bear hug. And there's an archer. See, like, remember when I said I never liked the archer's places, or that the archer's places are always going to be a pain to bite? Uh, bite. But, that would be why. Just every time you're in a fight, just archers always got to come by at the most inopportune times to help or to help out their comrade I don't know I find it kind of annoying of course it wouldn't be Dark Souls unless the odds were stacked against you but still 
I sound like I'm bitching about this game a lot, huh? Whoa, okay. Oh my goodness. Hello there, friend. I knew one guy snuck up on you, but I thought... I thought it was one of the guys from up here that I killed. I guess not. You just can't have some freaking crack in the wall. Uh, I think they call these guys like hide knights up here. I remember I was talking with my friends one time. I used this sword for a little bit. And I didn't know what else to call it. Uh, him. Because I couldn't remember that he was called like hide knight. So I called him the Caucasian Knight. That got a lot of backlash from my friends. <laughs> They're like, how do you know? His, you can't even see his skin. I'm like, but his arm was white. He's like, did say the White Knight with Caucasian? I was like, I mean, yeah. I like my friends. They're having, they have fun though. I make them sound like bastards, but they're good people. Yeah. Oh, hello. This is. Oh yeah. Okay. Wonderful commentary I'm giving, by the way. This uh, is I believe that was um, a Shakespearean quote from his latest novel, Goosebumps. Uh, yeah. True story too. Actually, I I never. I really like the Goosebumps series. I I'm I don't read for fun, which might, you know, strike you as surprising. Uh, air quotations. But yeah, I'm not a big reader. Like I, I'm currently in school right now, so obviously I like read textbooks, but I, I don't really read for fun. Uh. I don't know why. A lot of people can. I'm not saying there's not interesting stories out there, but I never one had one that actually grasped me. I more prefer to write than I do to actually read, which might be kind of counterproductive. But hey, you know, whatever. Before this guy comes in, and just destroys me because I can't block. Because didn't we make that rule no blocking? Yeah, I think I'm gonna use that rule. No blocking, only dodging. And I really like heavy shields too. Okay, so can I get a backstab on this guy? Well, at least they give you like the advantage if he gets up slowly, so he's kind of slow. All right, all right, come on, come on, Toro, Toro. Yeah, I remember you really fast, but I think you only do like three combos with that thing. One, okay, come on, do your three hit. One, two, three. There we go. Oh yeah, but I forgot you have a quick recover. Okay. I don't know how that didn't hit me, but okay. Leave it to the power of the dodgers. That's what I'm gonna say it was. Okay. Wow, this dodging things actually never mind. Okay. Okay. Okay, do I use a life gem or Estus? Life gem or Estus? Life gem or Estus? Life gems are normally used after battle, but I want to go with Estus. I'm going with Estus. Oh, hello. Should be my calling card. Oh, hello. Oh, I forgot to mention, I have dogs, so if they start barking and stuff, I'm pretty much going to have to uh, cut out the audio and make like dramatic cuts, so I apologize for any... Uh, drastic cuts. The only reason I say that is because they look like they're at the door ready to start barking. So, uh, if that happens, I'll be sure to uh, just cut ahead. Yeah, I see that second one in there too. I think if you go down this hall. Yeah. And there's no pause for this game. Wonderful. Oh! He wasn't dead. As, as I thought. Why on earth would he be dead? Oh, good, they give him max, so he's kind of slow on hitting. Mm, bolt. Oh. I thought he was going to be kind of dumb. Scimitar. Oh, shoot! 
I totally didn't even think of that. I've been like using my right-handed weapon the whole time. Oh no. That's really a downer. I forgot that they like really amped up the uh, speed at which her weapon degrades. Screw it, screw it, screw it. Go, 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 go. Doesn't even matter. Doesn't even matter. Doesn't even matter. Doesn't matter. Ask me if it matters. It doesn't matter. You can ask me as many times as you want, but no matter how many times you're going to ask, it doesn't even matter. Hurry up. Open the doors. They're coming up the ladder. They're coming up the ladder. All right, come on. Like the fire. Like the fire. Rest. Yes. And we're traveling back to Majula. Now we have a fresh bonfire right here. And now, the reason I'm back is to talk with... I really wish you could just level up a bonfires instead of just constantly having to come back to the Emerald Herald. Uh, Vitality... Dance... Dex. Yeah, looks pretty good. Pretty solid. Pretty solid. I'm starting to become stronger. Stronger. Faster. Better. I know this dude, or chick, has the, uh, the, my dog's looking at me with love in his eyes. He really wants me to pet him. He's, like, sitting here just staring up at me. I'm, I'm sorry, but I'm recording. I can't, Sydney. My dog, my dog's a boy, but his name is Sydney. Because when we got him, we were told he was an Australian cow dog. So... We decided let's name him, like, you know, Sydney Australia. So we named him Sydney. I'm an idiot. So, uh, yeah. I don't know why I'm telling you stories about my dog, but... Actually, while we're telling... No, that would be a damper. My bad. Uh, it's like a sad story, but it has kind of like a happy end. Whatever. I mean, I'll save that for a later episode. How long have I been recording for? Gotta check. This is so non-professional, just checking in the middle. 12 minutes, okay. Not as long as I thought. I do apologize for every time I do that, but some I don't have like really a good stopwatch or anything, so. I really gotta start using my left hand weapon more. Like, I am really just, it, it's funny because I'm, I'm left-handed dominant. I see you sleeping over there. I see you sleeping. We're gonna hit you with the left. They wouldn't see it coming. They never saw it coming. He didn't see it coming. Oh, hey, Nix. Anybody home? Oh, yeah, this is the uh, place with the, the. This is the place above. Man, these are like. Uh, what are these? Uh, yeah, not eerie. Uh, it means like noises. I'm gonna get that. It means noises, like background noise to like keep things to to keep the scene. I like to really sell the effect, like the birds chirping and stuff. What is that called? I know what it's. Ah, oh, divine blessing. There's like a lot of traveling in this game. Like, oh, I got an Estus Shard Fragment. Time to travel all the way back to Majula just to go reinforce it. Just to go back to the bonfire I was at before. Just to get more souls. Just to level up. Just to go back to Majula. To level up. Just to go back to the bonfire. Here to see you, however. Uh, okay, here we go. Mm, yeah. Take my shower. <laughs> uh, I guess you could say I... A sharded. <laughs> okay, we're back. Hmm. Where do I want to go from here? I know there's stuff down there, but I'm lazy. I really don't want to fight the pursuer. Like, I just beat him in my other game. And he, like, wrecked me. I know you can, like... Oh, wait, can I... 
Yeah, I guess I can parry with it, but I know there's like a wind up to the parry. Ow! Ow! Can I help you, sir? Because I just got here. I don't know what I'm doing. I really need to start like mixing up because I'm like just using the right one like a ton of times. And that's that's gonna end up really destroying me. So up here, I don't know why I'm like telling people like what is my audience right now? People that have already played Dark Souls or people that like don't know anything about it. Cause I, I, I like seem to like describe things for both. I don't know if you can hear my dog yawning in the background. But what it is, is you can fight the, the boss once. It's your only chance to do so. Uh, and then he never respawns back here. But I only use it to get rid of this firebomb guy. But you know, I'll give him a shot. Your pursuer. You know, without the battle music, he's like a lot less threatening. Whoa! Okay. Okay. Well, still threatening though. Still very, very, very threatening. Very threatening. Who's threatening? You are. Yes, you are. The dogs are barking in the background, but I can't. No. Stop barking, dogs. This is not the time nor the place. Yeah. I'm actually getting off some damage on this guy, though. I'm kind of impressed with myself. Alright, come on. Well, oh no, that floaty float. It's the floaty does. Alright. I know it goes through shields though, so dodge rolling kind of is very effective for me in this in this scenario. <laughs> Charge blaster! Uh oh. Woo! No! Ooh. Ah! Oh, okay. Use the SS. Use the SS! Okay. I was actually like really getting into that fight. Aww. Okay. I'm sorry for yelling, by the way. That was a really loud yell. Loud yell. Loud yell. Uh, see, the only reason I like started yelling was because like I thought I was gonna lose the fight because for some reason I thought I only had one Estus left, but then I realized I had three, so I was like, I, I was like staying with that damage because I was like, ah, well, I'll only use the one Estus when I really need to, and then I'll probably just die from there. But then I saw I had three, and I was like, no, oh, the movie can't end like this, but it ended like that. I know there's like one guy coming up behind me. He like comes up from that tree and hits me at the most of the time. My first time fighting the penetrator, I had to leave because that axe guy was there. And I just could not take on two people at once. Especially because the firebomb guy was there. So technically I guess three people at once, but I was at I was kind of out of his range for the most part. Oh whoa, how did I Is that a sprint jump? What was that? That's pretty cool. That's flashy. Wish I was good at editing so I could do like the nutcracker to that. Do 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 boop 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 boop. Alright, anyway. That totally degraded <laughs> my sword. Uh, dramatically. Uh, come on, do the jump, please. Wait, is he just gonna come up here? Oh, uh, he's gonna come up. There we go. I hate the pike guys a lot. I think that's what they're called, pikes. Spears. Uh, what's gonna be my strat here? There's like multiple things I could do. I know what I'll do. Okay. Oh wait, it's locked. Okay. 
on the bright side, there's a bright side though. Come on, come on, don't hit me. Don't hit me. Make it through. Make it through. Oh, you can get hit while doing that. You can get hit while doing that. Go through. Go through. No, 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 no. That's. That was. Was that 1,600 souls? Man, I was talking earlier about how, like, I'm gonna sound, I sound like such a squeaker when I'm cursing here, I'm really like, no, go through, go through, oh well, whatevs, alright, well I think that's enough for, uh, for, for, for now, my, my pretty little undead, it's going to, uh, I guess that's like motivation if you make like a really cute character in this game though. Because you like want to keep her alive, you don't want her to turn like fugly. So then, you know, you want to like stay alive longer. It's like the worst reason for wanting to stay alive in this game, but eh, it's a reason. Anyway, I think I'm going to end the episode off here. So, uh, 1,600 souls I think it was. Ugh. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the uh, next episode. Later.